welcome everyone to our team call. I know more people will be popping in. If you're able to turn your camera on so Carol can see your beautiful faces, please do so. I always love for our speakers to be able to really get to see you guys um, and have you engage. And feel free to engage in the chat as well. If you've got a question for Carol as we're chatting back and forth, you can put it in there and I'll, I'll do my best to get to the questions. If you're just hopping on, let Carol know where you're calling in from in the chat so she can see who all she's talking to. She is all the way from Spokane, Washington, and you guys are in for a treat tonight. A couple quick announcements before I introduce her. Um, Want to make sure you all are looking in your back office under events for local Super Saturdays. Lots of Super Saturdays are going on. Um, I'm going to be in Tampa March 28th for their Super Saturday event. I have one in Ohio on April 18th in Columbus, and I know there's several throughout. And if you guys are hosting or going to any and you want to fill everyone in in the chat, feel free to do that. Make sure they're posted in ISA for Wealth as well. But get to a Super Saturday event. Better than getting there, bring a car full of people with you. Nothing will grow your business faster than getting people to events. And we're probably going to touch on that a little bit tonight. Um, so make sure you're signed up for ISA Academy. Those are going to sell out, guys. It's going to be pretty quick. 500 people are going to be the max on those events. And now as we acquired a whole new company, all the Zizia people are going to be coming to our events now. They're part of us. We are now together. So they're going to be selling out quicker than we're used to. So be sure you commit. You can always try to sell a ticket later, but it's hard to get a ticket if it's sold out. All right. Last announcement. After this call tonight, you guys, I posted in the business page, um, Jay Bennett is interviewing Kathy Coover tonight and welcomed us on the team call. So if you want to do another call at 9 p.m., you can go click on the Zoom link posted in ISA for Wealth to get on that call as well. And it will be recorded too. So if, if you don't have time tonight, we can post the recording for you as well. All right, so I am so excited to introduce you guys to our guests for this evening. I met Carol in the Platinum Lounge and I didn't know her. I saw her um, talking with one of her daughters, introduced myself, and um, because our last names both begin with W, we seem to sit together an awful lot at the conferences now. And so I was, I just reached out to her and asked her if I could share her with you guys this evening. Um, she has been with the company for quite a while. She was the company's 58th millionaire. She's an eight-star platinum, seven-star crystal executive. For those of you that are new, that means she does have a platinum business center. So she's got her first original center. She's opened up a new center. And it means she's worked with a lot of leaders to have seven personally enrolled executives under her. And I'm sure she has a ton more executives under her because you guys, there are so many people in her downline that you know and love. People we've already uh, interviewed on these calls. Trudy Maples, Tanya Kirkpatrick, Kelly Dicker who, Flora Stevens, so many amazing, amazing people and people I didn't met, met, mention. She told me tons of her leaders um, that I didn't even mention, too many to mention, but she's earned all kinds of accolades, you guys, shooting star, legacy club, women of isogenics, but her greatest honor and joy is mother to Sophia and Olivia. And I've only met one of them, I believe. I don't think I've met both of them. So um, I am just so excited to share you guys with Carol. Carol, thank you so much for being on the call and sharing tonight with us. Oh, Cindy, you're so welcome. We're you're so, so welcome. excited. Well, I'd yeah. love for you to share, um, you know, your, your brief story. You know, how were you introduced to Isogenics? And, and then I'll start asking you questions from there. Perfect. Well, thanks again, Cindy, and um, good evening. I know this is like all over the time frame for many of you, but... Um, I think it's just amazing that you you commit to doing this. It, it says that you're willing to show up for life. So the bottom line is going um, this coming May, it'll be 15 years. And I met Joni Brewer at a trade show. And because my profession was in the pharmaceutical business, I had become very unhealthy. I traveled a lot. I had gained 18 pounds. I lived on Diet Coke and chocolate. And when I saw Joni Brewer and she showed me her weight loss and she said, you can release seven to 15 pounds in a nine day system. I looked at her and I said, oh, that can't be healthy. I don't believe it. And all the while I'm literally my whole life, I'd been a yo-yo dieter of unhealthy and who cares if it was 
I just needed to release the weight. And so did the system. She at that point said, Carol, you never know where this will take you. I want you to cleanse like a champ. Again, not even having a clue. I just wanted to release my weight. And so I did release 12 pounds in a very short system, jumpstart system. More importantly, I started sleeping and I had energy. Did not, and I like to just always highlight, I did not see the business out of the gate, you guys, because I felt as a single mom, I, I traveled a lot. I had no time to do anything else. I'd been with this company for 16 years. Um, I have to tell you that I had a very closed mind. I had a closed mind on network marketing. Why? Because I really didn't know. And that's what we find in general. People just don't know what we don't know. So we're going to say things that make us look important or make us look stupid is often what it does. Um, so for six months, um, you know, again, the most important thing besides weight was sleep for me and energy. And I have never looked back in regards to a Diet Coke. And now I have Isa Delight, so I'm good. Okay, so it was six months later, guess what? Doing the same old, same old, traveling and hating it because I, like I said, I'm a single mom. I went to China and adopted my two girls. As a single mom, I had a nanny with them. So to leave often, it just broke my heart. And the, the resounding theme was I didn't cross the ocean to literally walk away and let a nanny raise my girls. And it was in a hotel room one night that I had my, you know, epiphany around, guess what? I'll be here next, next week because that's what my job entails. And I'm going to be putting up with the same baloney of layer, a layer of management. At that time, you guys, I was one of the first women in the pharmaceutical profession in this arena. Um, and I had a lot of male baloney going on. Okay. And so uh, it was that night in the hotel room, I literally called Joni Brewer and I just said, okay, tell me what you're making, um, like today, you know? And she said, at that time, she said, Carol, I'm, I'm making 15,000 a month today. And she goes, what you, I want you to really understand that I will be at 20, I'll be at 30, I'm moving to 40, 50, 60, my goal is between 80 and 100,000. Well, Sorry, my blueprint couldn't even imagine that, but I'm like, 15,000? Um, I don't make that, and nor have I in my whole career. So I was good for 15,000. And it was there that, you know, we talked a little bit. She always, she reminded me, Carol, you're often complaining. I hear you complain about what you do. You leave your girls. You have a skill set that you just transfer it's just learning a new business model. And I know you could do this. And so it was that night that I decided that um, really, I could go to work for myself. I was going to continue to work for the stockholders and why not create wealth for myself versus the stockholders? What would that look like? Honestly, I had no idea. I knew I could trust my leader, Joni, as you are trusting leaders and people that you're connecting to because our job now going on 15 years later is just to cast the vision that this is real you guys this is a vehicle that can create financial freedom and you can have choices most importantly we all want freedom and choices with our children or grandchildren or you know nieces and nephews or caring for our parents because my paradigm from my children and having time freedom with my children now is I'm caring for my elderly parents. And now I get to talk about my paradigm of, you know, I don't have to raise my hand to a manager and say, can I go care for my parents? Okay. I work my life with my leaders and we cover one another and we work really well together. So it was that night that I made a decision. I don't have a clue what I'm doing, but I can trust Joni. And um, I told her that night that um, I was going to follow her wherever. I was taking the summer off because I'd never had a summer off. Went to the lake with my girls. And come September, I literally walked next to Joni Brewer, hip to hip. What you do, I do. I went to the meetings and I went and met all the top income earners. And I, I, 
of course, told him, you know, Carol Waldenberg, Spokane, Washington. I'm with Joni Brewer, you know, they knew Joni. And I just said, you know, why isogenics? And what gold nuggets would you give me? Um, and I also asked for the nuggets that you would never do again. So I wanted to learn from them. So anyway, it took me two years to attain six figures. And from there, about five years of millionaire. But what I want you to understand is that I often talk about what is sick care with big pharma owning everything, directing everything. I realized how really brainwashed I was working for that corporation. And then to walk over and just take a preventative approach to wellness in the name of what does a cell need? What do we eat every day that can affect disease management of hypertension, diabetes, fibromyalgia, you know, all of these conditions are inflammatory. And isogenics is a solution. And of course, I always give the, the sideline of we don't cure and all of this. But in 15 years, I've seen a whole lot of bodies really come into alignment. And then I talk about, let me just tell you what the square box of, of working for a corporation trading time for money. And then I want you to get really honest because as we age coming in, I was in close to my 50s. Corporate America is not nice to those of us who start aging because they like to age us out because they can get young blood cheaper. And I started seeing a lot of that happening. So what you do is become more fearful and you have to cover bases. And so then what's the other side of, of being an entrepreneur? What does that look like? And here's what I say, you can work hard for yourself for five years and with that hard work, you will have choices. As opposed to five years working for a corporate world, you will pretty much be in the same grind. You may make a little bit more bonus, but you are not gonna knock it dead. And even as a business owner, I have lots of business owners, they don't have the time freedom, their businesses own them. So with that, um, I like to really, one, tell you, it's not a pretty day every day in network marketing. Just like it was never pretty days for me in pharmaceuticals as I adopted my children. I had to worry about, can I get off for medical care? Can I see their soccer games? Uh, the highs and lows of, oh, did I make my quota this time? So, you know, the fact that we have things going on. I say, do not get distracted by anybody. The stay in the tracks of what your goals and your dreams are. Connect with your, your, your teammates that are like-minded because this is a lonely business some days, you guys. And you need to be around your colleagues and your, I call them our crazies, that really get who we are. So stay plugged in, get to the meetings, because it just gives us those shots in the arm of, oh my God, now I know why I'm doing this. You're going to hear multiple stories of lives that have been changed. And so the more committed you are to getting to events, and this is an event tonight, okay, the more committed you will be to personal development, to get into the goals that you choose to have, which ultimately is the best health you could ever ask for and the time freedom that you can ask for. Um, okay, so with that, um, I like to, number one, I want you to really look at the bottom line is get people paid. And, and how do you do that? Well, you get them to consultant and you get them to consultant by just being a good friend. You know, you know what, Cindy, you're feeling so good on day number three and four and five here. I know you have a sister, a mother, some friends who are going to want to be feeling as good as you. So let's get them on the line and let's get them some product. And ultimately, I want you to have your product paid for. So you're not going to do the business in five days, but you're going to be a good friend and you're going to help people along the path as well. Um, Okay, um, mom, 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 I'm just looking at a couple um, of notes here. Free food, always free food. Um, oh, I know. 
people that you want to, that you have in your site, whether they're old people from high school, college, whatever. And we hear this a lot on everybody's call, but go friend them on Facebook and go or Instagram or whatever. And I by no stretch am a social media guru, but I'll go friend them and start conversations, okay? And in the conversations, I often will say, I thought of you because you were a charger back then or because you've been a health nut or because you're a mother, I'd love to share what I've been doing for 15 years. And I think you'd be amazing. You know, can we schedule some time together? Can I send you a video? Will you take the time? I always try to drill in, will you take the time? And then can I follow what works for you to follow up? So I'm not just throwing it against the wall. I become more determined with, I really do want the appointments and such with them. Um, and you know what has been so successful? lately is sometimes I so believe in the product and I know it's going to work that I forget to tell them that what have you got to lose? It's a 30 day money back guarantee. So if it doesn't work, you can send it back. And I have signed three recently. It was like, Oh really? And I realized that, Oh my God, I forgot to mention that. So use the 30 day money back guarantee on everybody that you, um, that you remind. Um, so with that, um, I don't want to talk, you know, all the time. I want to give people, I, I love it when people drill on, in on, this is personally what's going on. How can I, you know, um, I need some ideas about this person who I've been working with for ages trying to recruit and, and it's not working. So if, if you're okay, I'd, unless you have other questions, Cindy, I'd love to open up. I can go, I always tell people, you know, remind me your questions because I can talk forever because I simply <laughs> love what I do. Yeah, so let's uh, drill in on what your guys' concerns are. Yeah, I've got a couple, but guys, if you have any, you can certainly, you know, unmute and, and ask, type in the chat box, whatever you want. But um, Carol, your, your story of longevity I love and your loyalty to the company and to the Coovers, and I know you speak so highly of them. We have so many new people on. What, what words of wisdom can you give these new people? I know you're, you're really great at that vision casting of all that's possible. And um, really, you know, that's what I think some of the newer people get so fired up about. So you know, what can you say to, to the ones that are brand new on this call tonight? Okay. Well, first of all, welcome. And if you haven't been in network marketing, believe me, you struck gold. Okay. And for those of you who have the experience, oh my God, you've still struck gold because you have this great wisdom and experience. Um, but what I want you to know is you can only be as great as leadership. And I have been on the field advisory board for two years, way back when, and coming from a corporate position, I was amazed at how, when we're on that board, they literally sit there and say, okay, now Carol, do you think that the, the um, associates, how is this gonna come across? Do you think that would benefit? They literally tweak the opportunity for us to grow in finances always. I can tell you I was here in 08 when everything crashed and that's when they came in with more money than ever and created the leadership pools. And as you can see just with NYKO, they are creating more solid foundation for us to earn money. So first and foremost, leadership is everything. And I have 100% um, faith in Jim, Kathy, and Eric Coover in doing the right thing for us. Um, like I said, there's going to be good days and bad days as in everything. But if I could just tell you, stay the course, get yourself to events. And this is about grit in life as in anything. If you wanna be a great tennis player, you wanna play the piano, you have to have the grit to do it every day. And most importantly, get honest with yourself of how much time have you really spent today on your business? And income producing is I've made 10 calls and I've returned five calls and I spent an hour and a half. Not how much energy do I waste 
during the day thinking, okay, I got to do this. Well, I should look at that podcast or I'm going to update myself. That's not income producing. That's developing ourselves, which is important. But we can also get really, um, really fooling ourselves of how much real time we spend. And the reality is, you guys, is if we spend an hour hard and productive, that can do a lot to take us to our goals and dreams. But I don't know about you, some of my days are spent thinking, imagining, um, talking about it, and that's not getting the job done. And so um, I want to uh, share one more piece of wisdom that I learned from somebody new. That's the great thing is, you know, the new blood. Shoot, we can learn from everybody and the young people coming in, amazing. I love it. I would always in my, I'm going to show my age, but I love black and white. I'm a visual. So I would often, okay, Susie started today. She starts her cleanse in two days. I write it down in my day timer and then I have marked, you know, when she is done with her cleanse, I have marked, you know, when her auto ship, la, 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 la. And guess what? My day timer looks like a wreck. So one of our friends last night said, get a separate calendar so that you have just a calendar for marking. Oh, Susie's starting today, her cleanse. She'll be done here. Auto ship's here. And you have just one document. And again, I, I give away my age because this is like the black and white. But I thought, oh my God, I'm going to really use that as opposed to my day timer is just looking too messy. So so how's that? That's great. And I know everybody's got different systems and you'll be, you'll be happy to know. I still have a black and white calendar that I write in as well. Um, and, and many of us use Team Z to track our connecting and following up and do it all electronically. So guys, it doesn't matter what you do as long as you have a system and as long as people aren't falling through the cracks and you're following up with them, that's the most important thing. You said one thing that I, I kind of want to talk about for a second, and that is um, you know, talking about the compensation plan. And one of the things that I've been most excited about since I've been with the company, since it'll be eight years in, um, in May, is that They've made a couple changes since I've been here, but they've only been financial enhancements. And that just fires me up. And I know coming off of New Year's kickoff, personally, I've never been more excited. Um, I've got a lot of new people joining the team. I mean, I've been kind of tracking the last couple of weeks um, how many people have been joining our team. We had a, 138 new team members last week, two weeks ago. Um, we had um, the same thing. It's like, you know, 100 new people joining us a week. It's, it's mind blowing to me. So with you being here even longer than, than myself, you know, what are you most excited about? Why are you still, I mean, you're probably in a position right now, you don't need to be enrolling three people uh, a week or, you know, still doing what you're doing. Why are you doing, why are you still doing it? And what, what are you most excited about? You know, Cindy, I have always, um, I've always loved people, I will say that, you know. But what lights me up is truly seeing people light up, that they get it, that they have results. There's conditions that come into alignment that just absolutely blow me away. And when I hear that, my response always is, that's why I do this. How, how can I not do this, you know? I have solutions that truly can create change in people's lives. And so I'm a Jimmy Smith. I'm a lifer. I have to do this. I cannot sit down in a plane and not talk to somebody and not ultimately listen to what they're doing, what they love, what doesn't work for them without offering solutions. And so really, I have always said it's the people we meet along the way that really excites me. It is the fact that now I have almost 15 years behind me. And I, if I can cast that vision for people to understand that, yes, this is the tracks. This is the boots on the ground. It does work. I never fluff it. I never fluff it like, you know, it's net play marketing. It's net work. But what I want people to understand, it's real and it can be real for you because I had no clue, no experience. And I bumped up against a lot of walls, but 
so what? You know, I had a lot of no's initially that bruised me. Why? Because, you know, I wanted everybody to like me. And I thought everybody needed this. And we know everybody does, but they just don't need it today. You know, they'll need it when their timing comes around. And now, through the experiences, the confidence of no, oh, you don't even bruise me with a no. It just means, like Jimmy says, you just don't have enough information today. So my goal is tap, 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 and somehow to give them information. And, you know, when somebody gets arrogant around me or they get pompous around they, what they do, I'm just like, oh, they just don't have a clue because, you know, I get to walk away and nobody owns me. I'm unemployable and I get to have such freedom with choices that they may have a title or they may have something, but they don't know the taste of freedom. And I just smile and I just know that, you know what, it's just not their day. And um, hopefully there'll be a time when we can come back or that, you know, there'll be another opportunity. So uh, that's so awesome. It, yeah. That's awesome. We were, I was on a, lucky enough to be on a bus with Jimmy Smith um, when we earned the welcome home challenge, when the new corporate office was built and he took the mic and he started talking and it was, it was glorious. I'm not kidding. He gave us so many um, golden nuggets, but he really said that he feels sorry and prays for people that say no, or that are ignorant because, um, you know, he knows, he knows, I mean, gosh, his family's made over $70 million in isogenics since they've been with us. And he started when he was 73. So it's absolutely mind blowing. And one day I'll get him on a call. He actually said he would be on a call for us. And then the follow up piece has been hard to get him to get back to me, but I'll, I'll get him on a call one of these days for you guys. All right. I want to open it up. Does anyone have a question they'd like to unmute and ask Carol? We've got time for one or two questions before we let her go for the evening. I don't care if you're new, I don't care if you're seasoned, if you're a top leader. Anyone have a question? Don't be shy. <laughs> no one has a question for Carol. I keep telling. <laughs> Oh, goodness. All right. So knowing, knowing, um, you know, we've now acquired Zizia, um, the compensation plan has just gotten sweeter with the executive leadership program. What, what are you doing with your team to really take advantage of that? You know, I'm, I'm always teaching and preaching to get to, I, I taught about getting to paid as executive since the get-go. Um, the executive match has always been enough for me, but then of course it was always the leadership pools. But now it's that extra $750. And I am sure every single person on this call could benefit from an extra $750 a month. Um, so I know a lot of people are pushing real hard to get there, or if they weren't, if they were executive and fell out, they're working to get back in. But how are you coaching your people to take advantage of, of all the changes and the enhancements to the compensation plan? Well, just like you, first of all, I tap on, well, what does that mean? What does executive really mean? It doesn't mean just five on each side, because we know that life is inconsistent. So you must have at least 12, at the very least, 12 on each side, okay? And sometimes when we're reaching to get to the goal, it's like when there's deadlines, okay, we'll go get grandma's, you know, information or whatever. But we then have to go make sure that it's solid on the ground with solid people. I cast the vision of what, what will $750 do for you and your family, okay? That's a guarantee. I don't know about you guys, when I worked for corporate America, I never had guarantees. I had, well, whatever my market share was, and I got a percentage. So if that's just the start, and then we can move it towards a thousand, that's a lot of money. And so again, it's casting the vision of let's go get them a ASAP into consultants. Let's me with them make calls then to take them to the other levels. And then let's together do, um, our goals are to do uh, sip and samples in their homes with their friends and family. And so I like to literally go to their turf and we're gonna make it happen in their turf. 
and we're going to develop that within, you know, kind of their um, arm, so to speak. And then we have at least at least once a month we have just a real intense business training that uh, is in our local area. So the goal is okay, make sure they're at that training. So we we move towards another big event, and then we at least have then group sip and samples where we can bring them into the rest of the team so that we can show the camaraderie of the team as well. So um, it, it really is putting the feet on the ground. Let's show you the levels. Let's show you the money and let's put a name to it. So that's mom and that's your best friend. Great. Now, mom and best friend, let's go help them. I'm going to help you call. I'm going to help you walk through that door with them. And you're going to, again, you're going to want them to feel like you feel. Okay. That's and I, I'm really honest with them that not everybody is going to have the vision, but that doesn't mean we're not going to share it with everybody. Because right. as we know, the nutrition works, so does the financial picture. And while I didn't get it out of the gate, I use that story as you know what, I was just so close-minded, but here's what I passed up. And so I use it as the story to tell the story of, I wish I had known. Yeah, so, so true. And guys, what I always recommend is get print the crystal executive bubble chart and I, with new people i have them penciling in their 10 people they want to get to consult and to help them and one of the best things to say in the beginning is i'm going to do this i am so fired up i'm going to be a lifer like jimmy smith like karen walden carol waldenberg and i want you to be at the top of my tree at the top of my organization the quicker you get in the more help i'm going going to be able to give you and use that um, a couple quick questions that came in and i think they're kind of like similar what what really worked for you back in the beginning as your approach in recruiting new people bringing new people on getting new clients Oh, I love this one because you guys, I didn't have social media. I'm a belly to belly. I'm like, talk to people. That's all. Talk to people. Okay. Find an excuse to talk to people. And by that, you know, at the gym, I'm like, oh God, I love your shoes. You know, I have the same ones or, um, you know, and I'm genuine because I will talk to anybody. Um, but you find reasons and ex ex excuses, whether it's, you know, somebody has a kid, um, their, their grandbaby's with them. Um, it's a spin class and you're, you know, I'm next to them and I'm going to compete with them today. Find a reason to set up conversation and to acknowledge people and compliment people is one of the greatest things we can do because I believe in our social media world, there's a lot of us who are very lonely because we work alone and we don't have that, that physical contact with people because we've isolated ourselves. And so go join network groups, go join a new church group, go join a new gym, go join groups to put yourself with people. I still love that better than social media any day, you guys. So I just find reasons to go to something, someplace new, because I walk out of my house every day and it's like, oh, I wonder who I'm gonna meet today that I'm gonna bless their life and I'm gonna make a new friend. I'm prepared, I have it in my, car i have samples i have stuff in my um, purse so i'm prepared if opportunities and ladies and gentlemen i still carry some of the old i mean i've updated them but i love our isa sales tools and such so yeah yeah and i do a lot of those things too and those of you that are whizzes on social media that works too and you know getting people on the phone in three ways is really really working for our teams that are in massive growth 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 right now so whether it's belly to belly sip and samples i know you know we talk sip and samples all the time social media whatever it is you have to talk to a lot of people to be able to have the results that carol's had to be able to attract the kelly dicker hoops they don't just fall from i mean i guess they they can fall from the sky you can meet them in an airplane right um but really it's because you're putting yourself out there and you're talking to enough people if if Jenny Elo didn't talk to Kelly on that airplane imagine 
imagine the people that would not have ever heard about isogenics. So uh, I can't thank you enough for being with us, Carol. I hope you've been reading in the chat. You're getting lots of uh, great thank yous. I know a couple of people had to hop off for another, another call, but we thank you so much for your time. Any last words you'd like to share with everybody before we hang up? Well, again, the fact that you're on here, it just says that you're committed to a goal. And in anything we do in life, you re it's a decision away. Everything's a decision with the action steps to get you to where you're going. And so really, I just have to tell you that the more action, the faster you run, the faster you get to your goal. And so, you know, run with abandonment because there, there is this saying, if you help enough people get what they want, guess what? We all win. And so what is that paradigm compared to what I came from, I had to be very selfish. I could not give away my secrets because I had to be better than you because we had a bonus pool, but my goal was to get more than you. So to be able to work with people and go win, win, how can I assist you and have it, you know, really benefit me as well. It just doesn't get any better than that. Yeah, it really doesn't. Uh Amen. Well, thank you so much. Thank you guys for tuning in. And I hope um, you got a golden nugget from Carol tonight. And Carol, I always post the videos and then I share with you everyone's responses and, and what they got from this. So I'll be following up with you. But thank you guys for tuning in. Have a fabulous week. If you need anything, please reach out. Carol, thank you so much. You're so welcome, everybody. Take care. Have Good a night. Good night.